And we've got two types of goggles there. The ones are the kinds that are Minnesota State approved. Those are the ones on the right. Um, those are the ones that you will be using in the lab. The ones on the left I picked up at Gander Mountain in the hunting area because people can, if they're going to rifle raid or something, try to make sure that they don't get shrapnel with like their goggles. So that's what's on the left. You might use it um, for mowing your lawn. I saw somebody mowing their lawn yesterday and they were wearing goggles like that. Not quite sure why, but you could. Um, you could, if you're in the wood shop, you should definitely be wearing goggles like that because they protect against flying objects. These also protect against flying objects, but hopefully protect against some other stuff as well. The paper that is behind there, making up the faces, is an indicator paper. It's going to show us or indicate whether or not something is acidic, basic, or neutral. Right now it's neutral. I'm going to shoot at it a base. That's what I've got in here. It's ammonia. Have any of you had ammonia at your house before? Isn't that yeah. stuff in chloride, chlorox? There's, there's ammonium chlorides. I don't know if there's any in Clorox or not. That's a good Isn't question. It what was that? Isn't it to breathe in? It's, yeah, it's, it's really bad with my dad. Yeah, it's stinky. That's why we've got both fume hoods on today. Um, it, yeah, it's very stinky, but it'll be fine. Um, it's a cleaner. It's a basic cleaner. And we should see a color change on that paper because that paper will change when it comes into contact with a base. So I'm going to spray this at it, and we'll see which one protects better. Which one's doing a better job protecting? The one on the right, absolutely. The one on the left, that's not so good for those people's eyes. It's a cool shade of red. It is a cool shade of red, absolutely. Yeah. We should make art with good really? Okay, so we always put our goggles on for any labs. This will be a good thing for your test on Monday. You always wear your goggles if anyone in the class is doing a lab or anyone in the class is working with glassware.